list three people in the testing space you consider as you know leaders? You know that's a tough question because we are at the testing conference, right? And now, you know, many people are, you know, coming uh, to my mind and which I really admire. And you asked me only for three, yeah. right? So that's cruel, right? All this. <laughs> anyway, um, I would start from, it's almost a year when uh, Jerry passed away, right? So I would start from him, yeah? So, so the Jerry Weinberg. He was not directly in a testing, but the work he put in, let's call it IT field, yeah. He had so much impact on the, the people that I will mention in the, in the, in, in, in the next step, bro. Right? So now I'm trying to go through through uh, through his books, and it's like um, something I I would never believe it's it is possible that I would be so surprised, and I would admire so much the books that were written like 40 years back. So when I say to people, you know, I, I give some 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 piece of his. Uh, uh, let's say some tip from his book uh, about consulting and I uh, mentioned this to the people say, yeah that's interesting let's let's discuss it and then I say you know that this was written like 40 years back yeah. 40 years back you know you, it's before you were you yeah. were born yeah. people already knew what the problem you will, you have right yeah. now related to the technology yeah. so this is how I consider the the also the leader right um, going forward um, Kim Kaner so uh, the what I've learned from him, from his um, uh, AST courses, right? And so uh, I, it's it's how, so all of these things made me who I am right now, I, I would need to tell. I didn't start from the, uh, from the context-driven approach uh, from the very beginning of my career. I, it was kind of the switch, but that's another story. Um, but uh, yeah, I, I really consider him as a, as a as a, one of the the, 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 the the most influencing person to uh, on the software community, right? And you asked me for the three, yeah, right? Sorry. Okay, so it would be hard because that, that's kind of on the, the, the same way. Uh, but I don't want to put them in the order. Is it fair? Yeah, that's fair. Okay. <laughs> okay, so I mean, James and Michael, uh, sorry, that's four, but uh, <laughs> I don't want to... Uh, do <laughs> yeah, just <laughs> sorry, James. Sorry, Michael. But yeah, but here's the thing. Um, I will tell you why. Um, so James and Michael, they did offer the free consult consulting on a testing on a Skype. Yeah. And I need to tell you that the moments, the the moment after that one and a half hour session with both of them, I mean, they were separate, right? I still remember. So you felt. So I felt. Like I'm the most stupid person, you know, in the world during that that session. I've been there. You've been there, right? But the moment, you know, you know, a 30 minutes, 60 minutes after the session, when you, yeah. you know, you cool down, yeah, you yeah. go through the the transcript of the Skype. Yeah. It is like, it all makes sense. And this is, I did it. It's not that he said this is yeah, yeah. how it should be. No, I said these words, right? And I, I, I still remember it was eight years back and I still remember what Michael taught me and what, what James did, right? So this is how I consider also you know, what's, what, what makes the people you know, so great, that they're great coaches, simply, right? <laughs>